talk about replacing your training line in your Extra Genie by taking the casing off. First thing you're going to do is recognize the fact that you need a new training line because you've worn the first one out. Could take six months, could take a year depending on your training. This is what the new one looks in comparison or what yours looked when you first got your Extra Genie. We're going to take the scissors and we're going to cut off the knot that you hook to your waist harness or to your shoulder harnesses and from there we are now going to take off the anchor strap. Now it might take some effort to remove it because it will be a little tight from anchoring the extra genie to your anchor points. From here now we can actually pull the rope out especially if we're set on zero. It comes right out. Now I'm going to take my Phillips screwdriver I'm going to roll down my protective ring and I'm going to gently remove the Phillips screw. Now it might be a little sticky at first but you'll be able to get it out. Now you could take it all the way out if you can just leave it in just a little and all of a sudden it slides off. Now that's what the inside looks like. From here I'm going to take my new rope I'm going to put it up through the adjusting hub up through the eyelet and then back down through the adjusting hub. At this point what I want to do is I want to tie a knot. I'm going to do a figure eight knot and with that tightened I'm going to make my loop. So now my training line is secure and ready to go and won't pull back up through the the hub and shaft assembly. I'm now going to take my casing I'm going to line that up. Now that's when you're on zero this is actually one revolution which shows one pound. There would be two pounds. From two pounds if you go all the way around you're now on ten pounds. So that's what it looks like on the inside of the casing. When you back it off you're back to zero. Now if you back it off too far you could add more resistance. So there's a little secret for those of you that have had that happen to you. Now from here you'll notice easy, zero resistance, take my Phillips screwdriver I'm now going to put the casing screw back in it should line up perfectly now don't over tighten this casing screw just get it in there and finger snug it roll your protective ring up from here I'm going to take my anchor strap put it back through I'm going to take my other end put it in and I'm ready to go for more training. Just a little tip when you go to anchor you also can put your snap clip through the side of the unit if you need a shorter strap rather than just over it. To take it off it comes off through the side of the unit just like that. If you need some more help text me 805-777-0168 or exergenie.com